is the unicorn. Oh no. Oh god. guys yes it's monday again i have no idea where the weekends are going or the weeks or anything i thought i'd give you a little bit of a heads up um i'm going to be filming quite a few videos back to back if you see me in the same outfit <laughs> don't panic i'm not that disgusting i'm just filming back to back because i've got a really busy week ahead of me next week so i wanted to make sure that i get as many videos out as possible so i keep posting for you guys so today i thought i'd do a haul of everything that i got over the weekend we did a little bit of shopping obviously as i said last week i needed to get a few bits i forgot to get a few bits and some places didn't have things so um i went to try and get my foundation and primer i was going to actually get the born this way foundation and the hangover primer but my debenhams does not sell these two faced items they literally had the chocolate palette they had the chocolate palette, I think that's all they had. Oh, I think they had the um, Hangover Eyes Primer Potion, but aside from that, they didn't really have anything else at all. So in the end, I actually went to the Urban Decay stand and I got the Naked Skin Weightless Ultra Dimension Foundation in the colour 0.5, so the lightest one they do. <laughs> and um, I've heard that this is a good foundation but the coverage isn't brilliant and I spoke to the woman at the uh, counter and she said that it's a buildable coverage now I've been burned before by buildable coverages but I thought I'd give it a go because everything else I've ever owned from Urban Decay has been fantastic so I actually have this on today and I'm so impressed I've got two layers of it on and then um, some of their um, slick matte setting powder and I'm very 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 happy with the results it isn't as full coverage as I would personally like yes I'm definitely going to try the Born This Way foundation when this runs out but for now I'm quite happy with this so that's the first thing I got I then went to the bag's broken I then went to Primark because if I'm in town I always have to go to Primark always and I picked up the fairy lights. Can you see all the pretty lights? So cute, so cheap, wonderful, love them. I also picked up this little plaque, which I um, will take this off and show you. It's a little unicorn. Eee. And I wrote a little quite a note saying, besides cheese, you're my favourite, which is obviously for my husband because sometimes he pops in my office in the morning because he takes uh, in my other job I have orders that need to be shipped out and he picks them up for me on his way to work which is very nice of him so I leave him little notes on this now and then also from Primark I saw these last time I was in and I wish I'd pick them up there was a couple of others I want to pick up and I might go back next weekend but I got these Alice in Wonderland <laughs> pajamas they are so cute and they have oh wait <laughs> they have a big a on them and look at the detail on them just look how amazing are they oh love them absolutely adore them i haven't actually worn them yet because i don't really they're too pretty to wear almost but i will wear them i might actually get a couple of pairs of these because I am just absolutely in love with them and so so happy and they feel lovely so they're gonna be great it is still absolutely freezing cold here I am actually in woolly socks today I don't know where the summer is <laughs> I remember waking up and checking my phone this morning and there was a post on Facebook about how we're gonna get a heat wave this week and we're about to burn Britain's gonna burn and I sort of look out the window and it's foggy and pickling down with rain and I'm putting woolly socks on and thermals so I feel that's not going to happen. They've said we're going to get a heat wave for the past like month and it just we had like two days of like really 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 high humidity but hardly any sun. We've had sunny days but it's not been really really hot so our summer at the moment is a bit... I also went to Boots. Uh, in my glossy box I got the 3 minute miracle Aussie hair mask 
and it rekindled <laughs> my love for Aussie products so I went and picked up the Miracle Shine Shampoo um, I haven't used this yet because I still have ooh, oh no that smell I still have a tiny bit of my LV left um, but that's what I'll be going on to next which I'm quite excited for was really loud. Then I headed to Tesco because I wanted to pick up a couple of bits that I can only get in Tesco. The um, oh, what are they called? You know, like the mini savoury eggs. I don't know whether you have them anywhere else, but they're basically a. Um, so you have a scot, <clears throat> you have a scotch egg, and you have the. So you have an egg. <laughs> Why can't I describe this? You have um, an egg and then you wrap sausage meat around the outside, breadcrumb it and deep fry it. Well a savoury egg or a mini egg is a little version of that where you have like chopped up egg in the middle and it's a small version. Well Tesco do lots of different styles of them and they do one called Garlic Kiev so instead of egg in the middle they have like a garlic cream cheese which oh, I absolutely adore. As to start doing them but they weren't as good. I'm not a fan of many things for Tesco but that I love and I will make special trips to get it. We took my mum with us as well because she needed to pick up a few bits and my husband went to look at all the electronic stuff as he normally does on games or whatever and my mum and I went and had a look around all the you know homeware stuff and we came across the stationery section and it is by far the nicest, prettiest, cutest stationery section that I've ever seen including paper chase so I picked up a couple of bits the first thing I picked up is this absolutely adorable little box and it just says bits and bobs on it it's got a lovely floral pattern nothing on the bottom and it's just a box that I'm going to put bits in I think I'm going to put in um, products shut now please I think I'm going to put in products that uh, I'm waiting to review so it can just live down here and yeah I think I'm going to go back because they had other boxes as well that were really cute and just adorable stationery things so I'm definitely going to go back in and pick up some more and I got this which doesn't fit on the screen it's a daily planner now I have a sort of life planner thing that I use for my for my normal day job but um, <clears throat> I also have a board for my day job as well but it's not got the room that I need to write down the filming I need to do it does take planning in advance on what I'm going to do so I like to make sure that I have a clear plan I, I'm someone who has to plan if people don't have a plan I don't understand them a lot of, to be honest the majority of my friends including my husband they just don't plan and it drives me mad <laughs> drives me mad nobody plans I'm just the biggest planner in the world I just love planning everything so I thought I would get this for my YouTube planner so it's got all the days down the side and it's got you three boxes Ooh, wrong way three boxes and then at the side it's got little post-it notes so notes and then a little clip and I don't know if you can see little stickers and it also came with a pen which I really really like and it's got a string on the back so I can hang it up I can hang it up just here but I've always got a plan on what I can do and I can keep up with videos and have video ideas so yes absolutely love that I also picked up a couple of birthday cards for family members and that's it guys I hope you really really enjoyed this little, little <clears throat> I hope you enjoyed this little haul that I I cannot pronounce words. I cannot speak. I need diction lessons. So there you go guys. I hope you enjoyed my little haul of what I got over the weekend. Um, there will be plenty more of these because I'm clearly just addicted to shopping and need to stop. But I won't. Ever. Thank you for watching guys. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the like button. And I will see you tomorrow.